Hey guys, this is Sam, and today we're talking about iOS 10.3.3, which Apple released to developers earlier today, which is kind of weird because they just released iOS 10.3.2 yesterday, and I personally thought that that was going to be the last version of iOS 10 that we saw before the public release of iOS 11 in the fall. But I was wrong. Today we're seeing 10.3.3, and we're going to talk about what's new. So for some reason, I guess I had enough free time to look through every single settings page between iOS 10.3.2 and iOS 10.3.1 beta 1, and I found literally nothing different. I opened a couple apps, the speed seems roughly the same between iOS 10.3.2 and iOS 10.3.3. I've looked at a lot and have yet to find anything new in this update. So what I'm feeling is what Apple's been doing a lot lately. They're focusing on security updates, and I'm pretty sure that that's what iOS 10.3.3 Point three will be centered around whenever it is released to the public, probably in around a month or so, but it could be longer depending on how long Apple plans to test the firmware. Now in case I missed something, please leave a comment down below letting me know what you think changed in this beta or changes that you'd really like to see for iOS in the future. Right now I think iOS 10 is in an amazing spot. iOS 10.3.2 is incredibly smooth. iOS 10.3.3 seems to follow the same trend. My only hope for this update could be somehow to improve battery life. I don't know how you go about that. I'm sure it's a lot that happens in the background, but improved battery life would be fantastic. And that's something that I would love to see in a future beta version of iOS 10.3.3. If you enjoyed the video, it would really help the channel out if you hit that like button down below. And of course, in case you haven't already, hit subscribe so you don't miss out on any future iOS updates. I've been Sam, I hope you're doing great, and I'll talk to you later.